Good night, mate. To set up your iCloud custom domain, go ahead and navigate to beta.icloud.com. From there up top, we should be able to click get started in settings. If not, just go ahead and type slash settings at the end of that subdomain beta. Scroll down and we are going to find hide my email. Just below that is custom email domain. Go ahead and click on manage. From here at the bottom, there is a blue button that should say add a domain you own. Click. From here, you have two options. You can either set it up for you and your family or only you. I am going to select only you. And I am going to add hi.contact for the domain. Click continue. And from here, I would go ahead and just click on skip for now and click on the blue view button. This is going to give you the MX records, the TXT and C name records from here. You're going to copy all of this information over into the into the DNS records for your domain. So for example, in Cloudflare, you just click on DNS and select add record. From there, you would select, for example, MX. And then for the name, you would just use at for the root, which is the actual domain itself. For the mail server, we would just copy over this into there. And then we would create another of the similar records and put that there. For the MX01, uh, you could just put a priority of zero or one. And then for the MX of 02, you could obviously put one or two. And for the TXT record, that's easy. You just click the, the TXT and paste in the value there using at for the domain or at for the name. So for the C name, uh, for host slash name, you're just going to go ahead and uh, add a C name record. And for the name, that's actually going to be the host, like that. And the value is going to be the target, like that. Perfect. So from there, you can just go ahead and that, that does not need to be proxied, I don't think. We just uh, save that how that is. And we could continue. Uh, we, we just clicked on. It would check your domain's DNS settings, and they would check out. From there, when you verify that, you could go ahead and add a custom email and then when you're going to send mail or reply or whatever you can go ahead and click on your from address and change it to your custom domain i hope that this has been helpful and if you have any questions feel free to leave a comment below i recommend if you are registering a domain because you do not currently own one that you navigate to hover.com that's h-o-v-e-r.com no, they are not a sponsor, but it's a great domain registrar. I cannot complain about them. They're just wonderful. Thank you, and have a lovely day.